What's up, YouTube? No, I haven't been on here in a long time. I haven't done any gun videos in forever. I do apologize to all my subscribers for that. But I've moved to a different location since I did my last video. I uh, can't shoot guns out here as much. I can still do gun reviews and things like that. I just, I haven't had time. We got moved and I've bought this car here. Kind of want to do a little sub project on the channel of something that I can maybe get some videos and things of uh, as I go. Um, I have put up a shop at my, my house, uh, the new place so that I can work on cars and things like that. I'm not really a mechanic, but I do like to tinker. Uh, but anyway, getting back to the car, we have here a 1966 Mustang. A um, couple of things I've done to it, the rear wing, some people like that, some people don't. I personally like it. I've had the front and rear bumper powder coated black. They're dirty right now. The whole car is dirty. I uh, haven't washed it in a while. Uh, brand new dual exhaust with uh, the Black Widow uh, exhaust on there. Uh, new rims, new tires. Uh, the interior of the car is pretty much stock. I've got some junk in there and some Red Bull cans. Um, automatic transmission. It's got the pony interior, blue and white. Uh, odometer shows 102,000 miles on the original 289 engine. Um, I did have that breather powder coated uh, as well. The car is grabber blue. Um, I've changed the radiator, put an electric fan. Uh, but this engine that's in the car, it sat for a long time. Uh, it's got a good bit of rust in the block. I tried getting the rust out with a couple of different methods. And unfortunately, the freeze plugs uh, are starting to go in it. I had to replace one of the freeze plugs and the other ones. I was worried that if I continued removing the rust that they would go out as well. So the engine pretty much has to come out of the car one way or the other. Uh, after speaking with a couple of mechanics uh, to see what my options were, I decided just to not use this engine. Uh, even though it does run pretty decent, it just overheats after a while because of the rust. Uh, but I've actually ordered a crate engine for the car. I'm going to change it over to a 302. That engine should be here in the next couple of days. So that should be pretty good. Uh, I changed the headlights those wired right up to the factory wire and harness so no modifications had to be made for those um, like I say the bumpers are powder coated pretty decent little car I've currently got the heater core bypassed if anybody happens to notice that that was because of the rust like I say new rims tires paint job turned out pretty decent interiors in decent shape other than the headliner I'm gonna have to replace it at some point um, all in all pretty decent car I'm going to do several videos on the channel uh, of this car we can actually fire it up and listen to this engine run runs pretty good sounds pretty good like I say it just overheats if you drive it for a while I do drive it around town and uh, have a little bit of fun with it, but hopefully that new engine will be here in the next couple of days and we can get it in and then I can actually enjoy the car the way it's supposed to be enjoyed. I do plan to daily drive this vehicle. So it's gonna be on the channel quite a bit as I do stuff to it. Anyway, I hope you enjoy this video. I hope you like the car. And uh, if you do, subscribe to the channel.